Hi guys. So in the previous um, video, we saw how we could go to the InfraEmptry marketplace, how we could uh, find products and solutions. We found a JScript, and we downloaded the JScript and deployed this in Smart Office. Now <clears throat> I'm going to look at the, another functionality available in the marketplace. And if I'm logging in as a user, if I've already set up an account now, I'm logging in. I can now use the marketplace to activate additional functionality, additional extensions to M3. And one of the key things is, of course, that I would like as an administrator uh, to be able to decide which applications that can connect to my system. They need to be able to connect securely. And if I go to my account information, you can see on my account that these are my downloadable products. See the OS 300 J script that we previously downloaded. If I now go to the licenses section, uh, here I can decide which applications should be authorized to connect to my M3 inventory availability. If I would like to revoke access, I can say I just cancel this and it would not be able to connect anymore. Apart from deciding which applications that can connect to my M3, I can also, depending on application, uh, decide that which users should be authorized to use this specific application. And we can also, when it comes to mobility, also decide which mobile device should they be authorized to use. So they cannot use any any unauthorized device if you want to limit access to have corporate devices connecting to your system. So once I have my users authorized, I have my applications authorized, uh, everything is set to go. So from a user's point of view now, I'm gonna stop the sharing of an admin from my administrator's point of view, and I'm gonna share my iPad instead. <clears throat> so if I go to the iPad and say, I would like to share my screen, uh, now, from a user's point of view, it's really simple. I'm going to go to the App Store, and in the App Store, I need to find an application, searching for in for M3. And currently, there is one app available. If I search for in for M3, and that's mobile first for in for M3, download, open, and since my administrator now has given me access to connect, I will just uh, log in using my user ID demo at lanesmift.com using my password. Uh, I can select that I would like to be remember this so I don't have to sign in over and over again. <clears throat> so as I'm logging in, it starts the default application that in this case, the default application inventory counting has some settings. So it prompted me with a setup page. I can also slide this to the, uh, my application started to the right and see my menu. And my menu now gives me access to the, the apps that I have been authorized to use. So one of the applications is uh, stock transfer. <clears throat> stock transfer gives me possibility to move, move items from one location to another. Uh, I'm, just gonna, I'm just gonna shut down this application and restart it again, just to show you that next time I'm starting this, it takes me into the inventory counting application that I had set as a default, switching to stock transfer, and just prepared a little piece of paper with three barcodes. I'm gonna scan an item number, and I'm gonna scan from location, and I'm gonna scan to location. So as I take my tablet and switch it over to a portrait mode, uh, and Bring up the little camera. The first time it's going to ask me, can, are you authorized to use the camera? Yes, I am. So as I <clears throat> authorized the camera, it started and it immediately scanned the barcode that I happen to have in front of me. And you can see that it automatically validated the item number, and that was not a correct item number. So I need to be, so I activate the camera now, make sure that I bring this over and scan the barcode for the item number. Uh, I'm going to scan it from location. So I would like to take this from this bar, from this uh, stock location. The quantity I'm going to move is uh, 33. I'm going to move it to location. And scanning the to location. There we go. And process. And I'm moving the inventory from one location to another. As you can see now, directly connected to M3, securely connected. I'm using an application that I've been authorized to use, uh, no more, no less. 
and I will only have access to the functionality that I can have access. So the marketplace as such uh, that you've seen in the beginning here, uh, it makes me possibility to find applications I need, but also securely manage which extensions are authorized to connect to my M3 system. So thank you very much.